All right, your birds, uh, if you're new to the, the 2600 Yaws, the Balanga, um, I have just figured this out, probably the last one on the bus for this, but these are the left inputs and the right input. Those are the outputs, and I've just got them set into this multiplier here, this little thing, and it's coming out of the output of this little monosynth here, and I can... I can play them both at the same time. I'm coming out of the CVs for this East Beast thing, and the MIDI cable is driving the uh, the Behringer. So if we turn that one off, we the volumes are completely independent. The idea here is that. I was using this mixer with a lash up of wires and everything everywhere. You don't need it. You can put it in here and save the malt. Um, if you've got something like this, this is a headphone jack. And even though this is, let me see if I can get that. I don't know if you can see that. That's actually a tip ring sleeve set up on the end of that. But you could hack the end off and put this in. And they probably make something like this. That's what I'm going to do. And then we'll save the multiplier and three cables. Um, so there's that. You don't have, you don't need, uh, you know, all the lash up of a mixer and, and so forth. I just thought it was pretty cool. So there you go. There's that.